Hi friends, here in this video, I will be explaining the centering operation. So, let's get started. Now, in the centering operation, this which I am explaining, it is performed on a lathe machine. Here we have this workpiece which is shown here. Centering operation basically means to produce a conical hole inside the workpiece so that it can be supported in with the help of the dead center which is there in the tail stock or in order to perform the drilling operation further. So at first we have to perform the centering operation because that also acts as the marking. After that we have to perform the drilling operation. So this is the axis of the workpiece and here we have this center drill which is a combination of center drill and countersink both. Now after we have understood this centering then the operation is performed in such a way like the workpiece is mounted. This is the workpiece which is clamped in the chuck of the lathe machine or we can say the headstock and then this workpiece needs to be rotated in an anti-clockwise manner. So the workpiece would be rotated in an anti-clockwise manner then here this center drill would be attached in the tailstock spindle as shown over here and then this center drill would be rotated here also at the end of this tailstock spindle we are going to have the hand wheel I'll just show it over here with the help of a rough diagram So this is the hand wheel of the tailstock which would be rotated and when it gets rotated this center, center drill moves forward and at the same time the workpiece is rotating. So the feed is given towards the workpiece and along the line of we can say the center line of the lathe machine and then this center drill would be producing a conical hole in this workpiece and now once this conical hole has been produced the hand wheel would be rotated in an opposite manner and then this center drill relieves or goes away from the workpiece and the center drilling operation or we can say the centering operation has been performed. Once the centering has been done, the workpiece can be subjected to further drilling operation, boring operation etc. or this conical hole can be used as a support because after we have performed this operation, we have to remove the center drill and attach the dead center in the tailstock. So it also acts as a support while giving the support to the workpiece so that we can perform any of the other operation like for example in case of knurling or threading operation we require the support from both the sides. At one end it is attached in this headstock. The workpiece is attached in the headstock. At the other end it is supported by the dead center of the tailstock. In this way we can perform the machining operation in a very balanced manner. So in short that was an explanation regarding the centering operation. At the end if you will find my videos helpful you all can like share comment and subscribe our channel and share it amongst your family and friends. Thanks for watching.